It's on to familiar territory for the Assumption Knights, but the first time back to state since 2008 when they won a state championship. The Knights take down Central DeWitt as Andrew Quested scatters five hits in a 10-2 sub-state championship win. The Knights get it going in the first inning. Zach Adrian comes up with a base hit to score Jake Gervas for the one nothing lead. Remember that name, Zach Adrian. Back come the Sabres in the bottom of the first as Jake Thuman scores on the air, tying the game up at one. Later on, it is three to one Assumption Knights, and they come up big in the third inning of play as Colin Gould drops the bunt single to score Caton Wallace. The lead is 4-1. Later on, the Knights add to it. This time it is Sam Bennett with the single to left field. Number six, Ryan Belk goes for it. He's in there, and the Knights are on top, 5-1. to one. Meantime, Andrew Quested has the great stuff on the mound, including with his glove. He snares the liner right there, and then he gets great support out in center field as Jake Gervas makes the diving catch. Gervas with a huge play out there, and then they ice the game away as Zach Adrian delivers again. This time it is a three-run bomb over the left field fence, extending the lead to eight to two, and Elliot Duax, he finishes the deal as he doubles to right field, scoring two more as the Assumption Knights win it 10 to two to advance on to the state finals. What kept us in it was, uh, you know, our pitching. I mean, we weren't as clean as we want to be defensively, but um, uh, it all starts on the mound with Quested. You know, and he, he was quality. They hit him hard a little bit early, uh, but settled in, competed all day, and that, that was the key to us, really. How big is it that a pitcher um, really trusts his defense to, to? I mean, towards the second half of the game, they were making plays. I mean, uh, diving catches out in center field, and just the routine stuff became routine again. Well, and it's, it's something we talk about is about picking each other up. You know, and, and one guy makes a mistake or one guy doesn't have a good at bat and the next guy, that's his job to pick him up. So uh, it's a team effort. You guys, it's been since 08 since you got down there. How hard is it to get there? You know, is, is maybe even getting there even tougher than like, hey, we're, we're here, you know? Uh, I'm, I'm usually more nervous when I'm early on. Uh, but yeah, I mean, since we've been in 3A, we haven't been there. I mean, we were 2A in 2008 and, and haven't been there since we've been in 3A. So. This is, a, this is a nice step for us. Mm -hmm. How about the ebb and flow of the season? You know, you guys started hot, you had some hiccups here and there. Do you feel like, boy, you face a really solid schedule to, um, and it's going to really prepare you well for state? You know, I, I think it does every year. Um, and I think, you know, we finished we finished the regular season uh, with six straight losses, uh, but we just kept stressing that it's how you approach the game every day, having quality at bats and, and being accountable to your teammates about how you play and how you prepare. So. Uh, just real happy for our guys. How big is what goes on in this dugout? I mean, uh, it's really positive. I think that's, that's one of the great dynamics here. Well, you know, it's, it's something that we had to have. You know, we, we weren't real edgy, and we, we thought we needed to be a little edgier. Um, we wanted to stay positive, you know, talking to our guys and not talking to the other team. Uh, and it's kind of outside of my personality, but, but uh, it works for them, and, and they're excited, and I'm excited for them. Last thing, you've been there and done it. What has to happen when you're in a state tournament setting from pitching to to making little plays, moving guys around? Uh, I think I think uh, be prepared for the situation. I mean, don't get caught up in the size of the It's a si little bit bigger field. It's a, it's a little bit nicer than most, and and don't get caught up in that. And, and, and the game of baseball is the same game. You go out, prepare for it, and then and hopefully when you get out there and the ball's hit, you make a play or you make that pitch. Just uh, prepare yourselves and then go out and do it. can't even imagine this happening right now. I uh, uh, just can't believe it. Well, tell me, you guys, you, you scattered five hits or so around, too. You had guys making plays, yeah. and you were letting guys make plays, let, letting them put the ball in play. Uh, yeah, you know, I trusted my defense, uh, put the ball over the plate, let them hit the ball, and let the defense made the plays. I came through when they needed us, and they came through when I needed them. So, overall, just a great game. It's been a season of ups and downs, you know. How special is it to get back there? I think it's the first time since 08. Oh, yeah, it's great. I mean, we start off the season, start off the season hot, and then... Uh, we uh, went downhill a little at the end, but you know we're playing good when it matters, so it's, it's all good. Tell me how this season has prepared you for whatever you might see at state. Uh, you know, us playing the tough, tough conference with playing in the MAC, playing all four A teams. We play one of the toughest schedules in 3A, and uh, you know our coaches keep saying that it's games like these that we lost in the regular season that'll prepare us for the tournament. So. It's really paying off for us now. How do you feel about this group of guys right now? Oh my God, I love them all. Love them all, you know? They pick each other up when you need it, and oh, just a great group, great group, a lot of fun. We uh, picked each other up, just kept hitting, fired up. You 
guys really manufactured some runs. A couple sack flies, that uh, that bunt single that scored a run with two outs, and then your 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 home run actually really put it away. Yes, it did. It felt great. We hit better than we have all year. Tell me how this season's preparing you for what you might face at state. Uh, I don't know. I mean, your competition is so good. Is that something you can really file away and say uh, we've really played some really good teams? Yes, it does. I mean, we play harder teams all year and then come down and I mean they still fight hard it's all we fight it doesn't happen to me every day you know our team did very well a lot of guys contributed contributed <laughs> and I'm um, just proud of our team mm -hmm. talk about grinding this one out too it's like you guys kind of manufactured some runs early on um, Andrew was was solid defense was making some plays and then the three run bomb really put it away yeah Andrew he pitched a heck of a game uh, I've never seen him throw that well Zach's home run, that was just incredible. Elliot Duex's double to right, that helped a bunch. And just guys rallying and get it going, that we got really fired up. Mm -hmm. Tell me how this season could, could may have prepared you for what could happen at State, all the different looks you've seen. You've seen some great pitching, and you've been put in a lot of situations that could really serve you well. Yeah, we started off hot. We've had a lot of ups and downs. Uh, we're just really bringing it together at the right time, which is very helpful. Mm -hmm. How big a deal is it that you guys get along so well? The dugouts really positive. I mean, uh, you guys kind of pretty intentional with that, right? Yeah, we're very close on and off the field. It helps a lot. Uh, we're all really great friends. We've known each other for years back, and it just helps on the field a lot. Mm -hmm. Well, it's been since 08, and they won it all that year, too. Yeah. Is that kind of like, hey, man, why not us? Too? I mean, it helps, but got to have Got to stay, uh, stay hot and you know just keep grinding. Mm -hmm. What's the key when you're in a, a three-game situation too, um, and they're kind of back-to-back -back there for a while too? I mean, you got to have solid pitching. You got to do the little things. Right? Yeah, we just have, just got to stay up. Uh, got to have a good attitude. Got to come ready to play every every day, and got to have the right mindset.